No, I'm just asking you, brother, are you going to physically die a physical death and then need to get eternal life body? I'm going to physically die a physical death and thank God for Jesus. that Because he's then going to raise you to eternal life, right? Well, no, again, this raise. why does he need to raise me to eternal life if I'm alive in him? Well, what does that mean to you to be alive in him? That's what I'm trying to get to. That I have eternal life. I'm just, okay, if you don't believe that we get a physical, new, spiritual body that lives forever with a new heart and with an incorruptible body that's literal, tangible, that can be touched, like the like the, the disciples touched Yeshua's resurrected body. If you don't believe that, is it going to be given to you and I? What happens to you when you die? Where are you going to be blessed from now on? Where do you get your eternal life? Where do you spend it? See, this would be the issue. This is where we would need to start that study. What we would need to do is go back into the Old Testament and really search and study and understand how they understood the afterlife and what they were hoping for. Because when we understand the hope of Israel, we'll realize that the hope of Israel was not about biologically dying and going somewhere. The hope of Israel was about restoration to the face of God, to the presence of God. And in Jesus Christ- Well, that's a place, right? Is, 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 is in your view, is restoration to the face of God? Is that a, well, an actual location? Well, what we've qualified here is that you believe the face of God is up. I believe the face of God is something that happens to a believer spiritually in their mind and their heart when they believe in Jesus Christ. My brother, I'm just trying to get you to give me a simple answer is when you die, where do you exist for eternal life that you get with faith in Jesus? I, I haven't answered, that. Sean. I, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm misunderstanding. I've not been simple. I, I'm just asking for a very quick answer for when you die, where do you spend eternal I'll life? I'll be with Jesus. Where is he? In the heavenly tabernacle, the new Jerusalem. Okay, where is that? In the spirit. In where the is that? What, what is that? Where is that? I don't know. You know, there's, it's interesting that you say that because there's scientists that have went about doing this exact study and have become atheists because they sought out the whole planet and, and all these. This is, it's, it's silly. Well, you mean, they, you mean they looked into a model that doesn't apply to scripture to find truth from scripture? 